defending USC featherweight champion of the world, Jose Aldo division is Jose Aldo. Creatively throwing elbows in the light seven months of rehab. Trying to mix things up his favor, Joe. Yeah, favor is switching stances. Good body shot and leg kick by Aldo. Those are the first significant strikes landed. Fight scheduled for five, five oh, minute big rounds. Big knee, big knee by Aldo. And a, and a big breath by favor after that connection by the champion. Good shot by Uriah. Yeah. And the swelling is leaking down to his knee. If you look at Uriah's left knee, Again. it is unnaturally swollen. There's not much he can do on that leg when he rips into it now. He's in a mounted crucifix here, and Uriah's in deep, deep trouble. Look how tight and precise that mounted crucifix is. The placement of the legs. Uriah's in a, a desperate situation here, Mike. Jose Aldo is looking, still trying. He's kneeing him in the back, and he gutted it through it. I mean, he was in that mounted crucifix for a long, long time. Last for the round. California kid. Fifth and final round. Featherweight title fight. There'll be more people who believe that Jose Aldo might very well be the best pound-for-pound -pound fighter in the world today. Jose Aldo dominates Sacramento zone Uriah Faber to remain the featherweight champion of the world. And still, the undisputed featherweight champion of the world, Jose Aldo Jr. They're gonna start ducking, and then that opens up the uppercuts in the knees. See a good little right hand there. Manny Wobble, oh. there's an uppercut. Manny's hurt, Jose Aldo on his back. Unloading, oh, hard uppercuts by Aldo. This is, it. This is it, this fight it is, is all over. All Jose done. Aldo retains his title. It is all done as Jose Aldo ends the fight in the second round. Wow, once again, number one contender in the world and making it look easy. This guy is a phenom. He's, he's in a class of his own. Oh, my goodness. He caught Manny Gamburian, and he sensed the blood, and the Brazilian Cobra absolutely strikes. Blood killer instinct. And still, the reigning defending WEC featherweight champion of the world, Jose Aldo Jr. Cut is under Ready. the eye of Hominick, which if you're going to get opened up around the eye, that's the preferable spot so the blood doesn't roll down and affect your vision. Oh, double jab. Oh, he's hard. Rocked again. Aldo on top of Hominick. A lot of time remains. They may very well stop this fight just on the basis of that swelling, because that looks like he's got an extra head. Wow, it's just, it just blowing up. Wow. You want to continue, Mark? That's what I thought. Everything is good. Everything looks good. Wow. In front 
of Aldo with a big uppercut. Aldo hurrying with that uppercut, Mike. Delayed reaction. Look at this. Hominick takes him Trying down. Choke him out. Nope. Seconds. Final ten seconds of this fight. Hominick and Aldo have gone the distance. Wow. What a fight. What a fight. And still, the UFC featherweight champion of the world, Jose Aldo Jr. Push like never before, but he leaves with the belt. Are you kidding? Are you ready? Let's go fight, guys. Undeniably, this is the biggest fight of his life. Florian in the black trunks, blue trunks for Aldo. Inside leg kicks will be very prevalent in this fight. Kenny opens up with the kicks. Now tonight against Aldo. He got stumped. There's the power. Oh, he got tagged. Jose Aldo. He got tagged, Mike. Stumped and hammered on. Kenny can take it, but that punch rocked him. He's pointing to him. What is he saying? Petit. Ten seconds. Bullpen battle to the finish. Distance. Five five minute rounds. Has Florian done enough? Or has Aldo defended? The real question is the three rounds that there wasn't a clear winner. Because there's two rounds where I believe Aldo probably very clearly won. The third and the fifth. The other ones, you, you know, you'd have to go over with a fine tooth comb. What do you score more, the, the dominant power of the leg kicks that Aldo landed, or the number of kicks that Kenny landed? And still, the undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world, Jose Aldo Jr. 15 seconds on the clock here in round one. And Aldo still trying really hard to separate those hands. It briefly does, but when as reconnects him, he's free. Oh! That's it! Trying to finish it! And it is all over! Jose Aldo knocks out Chad Mendes and remains the UFC. He just ran out of the octagon and ran right into the crowd. And they are swarming him now. This is nuts! And he did it with literally seconds remaining in the round. He just ran out of the cage and ran right into the crowd. And there's a near riot going on here right now. Joe, the official time of the knockout, 4.59. Final seconds of the fight. Oh! And they go the distance. Aldo and Edgar. I certainly gave the last two rounds to Frankie. The third round becomes a big question mark. <laughs> Pedaneras and Aldo are trying to put on a show to impress the judges. Still, the undisputed UFC featherweight Champion of the world! Very difficult to land strikes in the champion, starting from that. Oh, it looks like yeah. Chan Sung Jung's right shoulder separated off that last combination. And the big attack continues. Yeah, you can see something sticking out. He's trying to adjust it. Aldo saw it and started kicking at it. And now Aldo has him on the ground. He could finish the fight right here. This just showcases the touch. Jose Aldo on. looking for the finish. Trying to defend his belt. And it is all over. Jose Aldo remains the UFC featherweight champion. The champion. The challenger.
Sir, are you ready? Sir, are you ready? Fight! Here we go! Ricardo Lamas and Jose Aldo. Big questions for Lamas. First of all, what does he do to stop the leg kicks? Can he handle them? And if there have been any criticisms of Aldo, oh, beautiful combination. Nice combination. It's been that Aldo doesn't open up like he did when he was a challenger. Five. And he is the former champion, oh, of course. Oh, big Caught kick it. to the body by Lamas. But Jose Aldo chasing him down. Always got to watch out for the flying knee. Lamas did a good job there, though. Of, but even more so now. Because George St. Pierre is out, and because Anderson lost to Chris Weidman, Oh, beautiful setup. Again, he faked the great knee. combinations. Oh my God. Fantastic. That's just nasty. It's perfect. Threw a couple real hard kicks there, and he's swinging for the fences here against. He presses Lamas up against the cage, and it looks like he's trying to take Lamas down, and he does. Now Lamas has got to buck up and go out the back door, and he does. Get to his feet quickly. He's got to get to his feet. And now Lamas is on top. Look at this. Aldo tired. Lamas on top. Great control of posture by Jose Aldo. Ricardo trying to shake, shake him off. off. Yeah. Final you know, 10 seconds of this championship fight. Good job defensively by Aldo here. Final seconds. It is all over. They go the distance. The belt on the line at 145, Jose Aldo and Ricardo Lamas. I think Aldo did enough to defend the title, but I was impressed with Lamas, especially in that final round. Lamas waited, as we mentioned, for this opportunity tonight. He's a tough kid. He is, and he left it all in the octagon. Still, the undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world, Jose Aldo Jr. It's time! Here we go! Blue trunks for Chad Mendez. Green trunks for Jose Aldo. Mendez with the early leg kick. He's putting pressure on right away. The whole theme of his training camp was to make Aldo work. Aldo is, in my opinion, most dangerous in the first round. Mendez really wants to mimic the game plan of Frankie Edgar. We saw in that first round, Edgar took a lot of damage. Back to his oh, big left hook by Jose Aldo. He lands again on top. Trying to finish Mendez. Mendez has got to try and control all those wrists here and recover. That's another big left. Oh, and he's Full in the mouth. 20 seconds on the clock. He rocked him. And Mendez is out. Mendez strikes first. Caught him with the left. And again. Oh. Two hooks. Oh, nice right hand for Mendez. Pushing forward. They go the distance in the rematch. And stay.